welcome back to our mukbang. Welcome back. Woo! Today we have the infamous Ramdan. In Korean, we've been calling this japaguri because it's just japagetti and noguri together, two different types of ramen brands. If you mix them together, you get this precious meal. Let's look at that. Oh my god. These noodles were actually featured in the movie Parasite. If you've watched it, let us know. It was such a good movie. It was. Yeah, I took her to go watch it with me and it was her second time watching though. I watched it like five times. My first time was in Korea when it first released. I was like, they need to bring it to the States. And they did. And they won the Oscars. Wow. It was a good movie. Oh. I watched it like three times. I didn't really understand the first time I watched it. I felt like there was a lot of symbolic things and she was trying to explain it to me. But I watched it again and then I realized what it actually meant. So this is supposed to be like a black bean sauce mixed with the spicier ramen sauce. We're gonna try it. She hasn't tried it before. I've never tried it, but this has been around for a while. Yeah, I've been making this since a long time ago. It was yeah. first um, widely known through the TV show Superman is Back, the Korean TV show. That's where I learned it. I never tried it, but she grew up eating it and I remember she used to rave about it all the time. It's about to change now. Yeah, it looks really good. It smells good too, so. Oh, and we added the little meat on top, mm -hmm. the little pieces of beef. That's how they did it on the movie. Usually I eat it without it. It's good without it too. So if you don't have it, don't sweat it. And of course, we have some kimchi. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, we have some sriracha sauce. I need hot sauce with everything. Literally everything. We can see that. I'm gonna put some sriracha on mine. Just that side. Okay. It already has some of the spice in these noodles because we're using the packet and there's no soup in this, so it's a little more it is spicy. saucier. Yeah. yeah. I mean, when Beyonce said, I have got hot sauce in my bag, I literally felt that. It's digging. <laughs> I don't know why she brought me chopsticks. She knows that I cannot use these chopsticks for my life. You cannot eat ramen with a fork. I mean, really? <sighs> I'm red. Because <laughs> I'm red. You ready? Yes. My first bite, the meat, <laughs> the noodle. Mmm. 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 That's good. Mmm. <laughs> mm, I already knew what the noodle was gonna taste like, but with the meat, it's pretty good. The meat is soft, huh? It's really soft. Mmm. 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 It's good. Oh, I can see why you like it. It's good. I've been trying to make this for you since we were little. It's just like, nah, nah. Nah. I even offered to make it for a second. Like, nah. Because I don't really like japagetti. I was like, please, I want you to try it. Mmm. 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 <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so good. I told you. It's really good guys. I'm shook. I'm shook -ass. If you guys have black bean noodles before, just imagine it with a hint of spice from ramen. I don't know. It has to be a noguri though, that specific brand. Noguri is spicy seafood ramen too. That's why, So yeah. it kind of has a hint of seafood flavor. Yeah, so make sure you guys get the right brands. We'll link it down below for you. Bomb. So good. Wow. It's actually so good with the meat. I take back what I said. Try it with the meat. Mm -hmm. Got kimchi in there, kimchi with that extra texture and crunch. Mm. Mm. Bomb! I can definish this. That's really bomb. I'm so shook at how tasty it is. Would you ever make this? 
I would. I'll just ask you to make it for me. <laughs> I made this. What a chef. She cooks. She did make it. Mm, it has a little bit of spice, not too spicy, but it's like perfect amount for me. Oh my god, this is really good. I'm so hungry. Me too. And this like really heavy the spot. This. Yeah. We actually made four. Yeah. Two of the chapagetti, two of the nagori. This is our first meal of the day, so we're kind of starving. We actually recorded a mukbang yesterday too. Oh my gosh. But of a different food. And we lost the footage. When I tell you that we were devastated. Oh, we were searching the camera, the car, the laptop for hours and just we couldn't find it. Yeah, we lost the footage. It was so sad. This is a blessing in disguise because this food is actually really good. And it's good. Mm -hmm. What are these little green stuff? It's from the nobody packet. They're oh, little like seaweed bits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Jenny, I should put the steak in my mouth first. We need a little sriracha. Oh, you know, like, when you're really enjoying the food, you start kind of, I don't know, having a runny nose. Yeah, I'm kind of... <laughs> thought I was the only one doing that, yeah. That's me. That's when you know it's a good meal. Yep. I'm gonna put this in my mouth first. Mm -hmm. Basically how you make this is you just boil the water enough for how many noodles you're gonna cook. You cook the noodle, you drain the water out, but leave a little bit of the water left so it gets a little bit juicy. Very little. little. Very little. Not too little, but little. Or just pour some hot water on the side so you can just add it whenever you want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you put all the sauce packets in and you just mix it in there. It's kind of like carbonara, like purula. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you tried the it's cheese... Like Carbonara or the burdak or any of those sam Samsung <laughs> What is it called? <laughs> oh Samyang 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 I was gonna say Samsung And then what we did is we just added some beef on top Yeah we added some steak thin or like steak Thin steak yeah, yeah. <gasps> Secure your bag. I didn't say anything though. You did something though. The steak is pretty good, huh? Mm hmm It goes with these noodles really well. It's soft too. It's my first time trying it together. It's really good. Mm. 
Mm-mm. Is it spicy for you? No. It's like perfect. Mm. Don't you ever have those thoughts where like, oh, my sister was right. She, this is actually good. Maybe no. I should listen. But this is one of those cases. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm just kidding. And guys, it just hit me. I'm telling you, I eat, I eat, I eat, and it just hits me at once. I worked out today, so I'm extra hungry. After quarantine, I just stopped working out. Mom, take it in. Oh, I'm full. Ooh. That last bite was like... <sighs> I'm full. I don't think I could eat anymore. Yeah, I think I don't want to force myself either. Food coma. What are you going to do after this? Maple story? <laughs> what about you? <clears throat> I'm going to watch Real Housewives. I don't know. Quarantine. Hey guys, so we are done with our meal. We have a few little bit left, but we are so full and we are not gonna force ourselves. That's something that we don't do. Yeah. We don't like wasting food, but we don't like forcing ourselves either. Let us know if any of you guys have tried this at home and let us know how you liked it. If you have any other recommendations for us to try while we are home in this quarantine, yes. go ahead and comment down below and let us know. Don't forget to follow our new TikTok account. Ooh. We have individual accounts and then we have the joint account. So make sure you go and hit every follow button and you'll see what we have cooking up. Thank you guys so much for tuning in once again. Make sure to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Hit that like and subscribe button. Make sure you guys have post notifications on so you can see when we have our next video up, which is next week. I hope you guys stay safe during this quarantine and until next time, see you on our next mukbang. See you then. Bye. Missing someone